Hi, this is Evan Anderman, and in this video I want to share with you my process for taking photographs from my airplane. I keep my Cessna 206 at Centennial Airport just south of Denver because it's a good jumping off point to easily reach much of Colorado. I fly over the eastern plains often, sometimes several times a week. I depart early in the morning or late in the afternoon, and it takes about 30 minutes to reach many of the locations I like to see. Once I get away from the airport and any traffic, I engage my autopilot and start looking for compositions. When I find something I want to photograph, I open the window and point the camera down at the landscape, look through the viewfinder, and start shooting. I like to see my subject from all angles, so I direct the autopilot to turn, generally to the left, so I get a better view of the landscape. My first priority is obviously to fly the airplane so I always keep an ear out to hear any potential change that would indicate a problem. The airplane is obviously moving quickly, turbulence bounces the plane around, and the cameras can be persnickety. It's a balancing act keeping the camera steady in my hands while getting the best composition. I can't put the lens too far out the window as the slipstream will vibrate it. A lot of things have to come together to make a good picture, and some days go better than others. I like to fly over some places again and again just to see how things change. I also like the challenge of arriving at a new location and looking at it to see what is important, then try to capture that with my camera. Sometimes I do Google Maps research beforehand to help me pre-visualize what I might see when I arrive at a new location. There are a lot of variables that control how a picture turns out. That's why I like to see things repeatedly to get the best picture possible.